Hey, what's going on guys? All right, so here's the deal. I got this knife here. This is called the Easy Knife. And uh, I got this in the mail today. And uh, I have no idea who sent it to me. I mean, I have a name, but I don't know if it was a viewer who thought I should try this or if it was the company sending in. I, I really don't know. Um, but I opened it and there's, there's no explanation to what it is. And I'm like, okay, well, it's blunt. It's not sharp. Obviously, it has a bunch of... Uh, cutouts in it. So I had to look it up. I googled it real quick and apparently this is the perfect solution to spreading cold butter. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna test it out. I'm very curious now. The, the idea here is that when you have cold butter straight out of the refrigerator or something it's very hard. It's not spreadable. If you cut a little piece off and you go to spread it, uh, I have an English muffin here, you go to spread it, it's just it's chunky, it's not really spreading very easily. Okay so the idea is that when you're you can use the three different functions here all right, so when you're dragging this basically across the butter, you're pushing it through these smaller holes, therefore creating more surface area, it, it's melting quicker, and it's supposed to be easier to spread. So you basically have a long run of these small uh, cutouts, then you have a single one on the top, okay, so you can run it like this, and then we have a long straight one. So we're gonna try all three of these and see how it works out. So I got some cold butter straight out of the fridge. Give this a little test. All right, so first, let's try. I mean, this you see how the handle is shaped here, uh, so this is basically your leading cutting edge. So I'm gonna try that first, okay? Oh, wow, all right. So I get the idea here, drag it across a couple times. I have a lot of smaller strips of butter, which well, it seems easier to, uh, it's hard doing this behind the tripod. It's definitely easier to, to spread. Let's try that again. All right, it takes minimal effort. Gathered a bunch through the back side there. Well, it's definitely easier, for sure. Um... The one thing I, I'm going to tell you right away that I think is pretty obvious is that um, you will lose a lot of butter in between these holes here that just you're not going to get out, okay? Uh, so you might go through butter a little bit faster. Uh, besides that, because the holes are there, it makes spreading a little bit more difficult. It's not really a big deal. Obviously, you can see it's, you know, able to spread. Um, yeah, that, that's pretty much that. Let's try just the top part. Let's say I only want a little bit of butter. All right, see how that's working. Let me, let me spread this on here and zoom in. I'm sure you guys can see it anyway, but just in case you can't, so you can get a good uh, butter action shot here. All right, so here's our knife. Let's use just the tip as you drag across. You can see it's pulling the butter through that opening, that hole. All right, now you have a spreadable product. There we go. All right, zoom out. All right, last thing to try, of course, is that big open back part. Yeah, that's kind of working the same way. If I come in on an angle. Yeah, come in on an angle. Seems to uh, work well. Let's try this other piece here. Yeah, this, the spreading part of it's a little bit, it's a little bit difficult because what's happening is as I'm dragging this across, the bread wants to be, it's grabbing in all these little holes in the front. So, uh, yeah, I wouldn't use, I don't know, the back one, I would disregard that. The side and the front actually works fairly well. I do like that. All right. So there we go. Now we have a, a knife that's going to be way more difficult to, um, to clean. So, you know, I got mixed feelings on this. I think this is a great way. It's almost like you, like I kind of want two knives. I want to use this to, you know, to, to get a lot of fine spreadable butter. But then I kind of want to scrape it off on a regular butter knife and then spread it with that, you know? I'll tell you what I would love to see is I would love to see a design that's very similar uh, to this. Only maybe the back side has a separate spreader. Does that make sense? All right, so you collect your butter through your, your blade. 
you basically smear it real quick onto your, your item, flip it around, and then use like a spatula butt end to, to spread it maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I'm kind of torn, guys. What do you think? Leave your comments down below. Uh, very interesting, for sure. The easy knife. Uh, is it easy? Definitely works in getting the butter off, but as far as spreading, I think it's counterproductive, you know? So, hit or miss, I don't really know. I'm kind of kind of on the fence with this one. I don't think it's something I would particularly purchase, um, but it certainly is interesting. For all those people out there that have to own uh, a lot of kitchen gadgets, this is something you need in your collection, is the easy knife. So anyway, your thoughts and feelings down below. If you have one of these, let me know what you think of it after using it all the time. But my first impressions is it's a really great idea, but needs to be executed slightly differently. So that's all. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you soon. Take care.